Hey everybody, um, second video tonight um, have basically compared five different lenses. Um, I work on the technical aspect of some of the uh, worship mob videos and what we're doing is trying to, to balance our color and get uh, some consistency through gosh even up to 15 cameras some nights. So what we have here is basically a 24 millimeter pancake lens, a Canon EOS lens moving up to a 40 millimeter pancake. This is a 50 and it just didn't didn't hold up. I was kind of excited about it. Bought it with um, well I had the lens, bought a converter. It's an older um, manual focus lens but we'll have to mess with that a little bit um, see if it's going to work with lighting this is an 85 um, Canon EOS lens and all these are converted onto an EOS M1 um, with an EOS to EOS M converter um, and then this one is a Tamron 7200 a little bit different so what I'm going to try to do so we actually white balanced custom white balanced all these so all the whites are going to be true white white now what i'm going to go back and see how easy it's going to be to add kind of a look like if we wanted to warm this up so essentially i'm going to add an instance of color finale and then we are going to go through and kind of see what we can do with this um, so, if I can get back to open color finale, and we're going to open the color wheels here. <sighs> and I'm just going to mess with this a little bit to kind of move some of this a little bit towards the, uh, the warmer. Um, and, and really right there even can can help. The first thing before we even get into color correction um, that you're supposed to do if you look at your video scopes is make sure you balance the uh, balance the luma. So essentially we don't want to have our whites too white so we would go to the top of that 100% bring the darks down to about here and then see if we need to raise up probably will raise up the mids a little teeny bit and um, so that would be balanced there within that shot and I've already kind of moved up towards the red a little bit and um, I kind of like that so I'm gonna leave that and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna copy um, this instance with a command C and then command well let me actually I need to know what to paste this to I'm gonna make all of these available to put in color finale on so I'm gonna do the exact same thing with each of the other instances and basically if we open our color finale on even all of these it's going to give us kind of that warm look that we might be looking for. Um, let's open the one on the Tamron here. Because that's just, it's just not quite the same. <laughs> but you can see, you can mess around with the color to, to, have, a, to have a look. And it's just kind of nice. So anyway, that just kind of kind of lets me know that we can shoot and, and mess around a little bit with this and kind of balance in between our shots. Um, I'm not so sure I can balance the Tamron with anything else, but uh, kind of looks looks pretty good. And Command Seven to pull that back again. Um, and there's all kinds of other things we can do with this. We can 
throw a vignette around it. We can do a whole bunch of other stuff, but um, so again, let's look back here um, at the 40. That's basically with with the uh, color off. I'm not seeing any change. Oh, that's because we just <laughs> we just changed. I think the other. Okay, so yeah, that that's interesting because now it looks so much greener to me and blue. So with the c color finale and making that warm, I think that that looks really pretty fabulous. Um, turn that off, and that's the custom white balance that we had initially. And then with a little bit of um, increase in the reds, I think that looks pretty good. So anyway, just a little experiment here with custom white balancing and then coming in afterwards and creating kind of a color look. And gosh, there's there's so many other looks that you can do. Um, for example, you can throw a look on like that. I'll take the color finale off, but now the combat is there. Um, you can do, I'll pull that one off. Dry heat, for example, is another one. That's not too bad. Kind of contrast, it's up, up a little bit. I'll pop that dude off. And again, we're kind of doing most of our work post in, um, no, I don't like that one at all. I'll just step that right back off. Heat wave. Oh, <laughs> that's not going to work either. Isolate. Oh. Memory might be a little fun. That's kind of in a film look to, to go back and have a memory. Old world. No. Romantic. That might be kind of an interesting look. Now it pushes all the the lights kind of crazy. Uh, old world still on. Take that guy off. The teal and orange is something that we've kind of liked. Um, eh, not in this case. Tritone. No. Not really liking that, and, and you could make a look and and really kind of mess with it a little bit. So to be honest with you, I like what we did in color finale. So that's kind of the final. Um, it's really hard to to see in the setting of, and I'll flip over to kind of what some of the worship mob stuff looks like. We're actually uploading another video. But the, the latest one that just came out, if I can find it here, and of course we're going to have to go through a commercial. So you can see how warm it is. But those are kind of some of the things that we want to be able to accomplish consistently. All right. So that's the uh, latest little tech. Let's see how that balances in between. Yeah, that's this is more pinks and reds, it looks like. Um, but like I said, you can you can mess around with the gamma curves and uh, and come up with something. Um, that would work and then you can set it as a preset and some of that kind of stuff so kind of fun um, I think that's about all any questions leave comments down below and we'll kind of go from there